the past couple of years, open water swimming has grown massively. Part of the open water swimming scene that's seen a big boom is wild swimming. With more and more people discovering wild swimming and more locations popping up on a daily basis, people are now taking risks on where they can swim and how long for without checking whether it's safe. So without further ado, I'm Sean from Simply Swim and here are our tips to stay safe when wild swimming. Know your capabilities. When going wild swimming, you really should go with someone else. But if you do go swimming alone, make sure you trowel a float behind you on a cord in case you run into difficulties. When wild swimming alone, you should start with a moderate pace and build up your distance. And of course, keep as close to the shore when possible. The biggest cause of injury is overestimating your own abilities. Take care when entering the water. Some of the best wild swimming spots have steep cliffs, slippery rocks and other hard to get to entry points. So it's time that I sounded like your mum. Never run on wet rocks. Jumping into the water from a high point is a big no-no because you may not know how deep the water is and if there are any obstructions. Be safe, take your time, it's not a race until you're in the water. Think smart, injuring yourself before you even step one toe into the water is just plain silly. And remember, the water will be much colder than you expected. Which brings us on to our next point. Cold temperatures. Cold shock is a real thing. It's the body's involuntary response to the dramatic temperature change. You will start gasping for breath and your heart rate will increase. So the key thing is not to run or jump into the water. Walk into the lake or river slowly so your body can adjust to the temperature change. And you'll know if the water is too cold for you due to the heat pretty much leaving your body, meaning you're unable to swim. A lot of swimmers try to push through the cold water, but as soon as you start to shiver or if your teeth start chattering, you need to get out of the water and warm up. Quick tip, if you want to stay in the water longer and swim further, why not buy a wetsuit? Cramp. Cramp is one of the most common reasons why swimmers tend to stop early in their swim. So before you enter the water, do some light stretches. Keep hydrated when swimming and don't tire yourself out. If cramp does occur, then call for help, float on your back and paddle back to shore. Currents. Now, when wild swimming, you're gonna come across currents. Sure, swimming against a current can be fun and make your swim more of a challenge. But this could also mean the potential to get carried away downstream is high. Currents can also throw you against rocks and other hazards, so don't push yourself too much. Currents tend to be stronger near waterfalls and words, and you should also be mindful of undercurrents as well. If you're new to wild swimming, then you should always learn in shallow water near a shore. Leptospirosis and world's disease. Before jumping into a pool, lake or river, make sure that you have researched the area first. Leptospirosis is spread through rat urine that live in the waters near storm drains and sewers. If no information is coming up about the area you want to swim and you can't see what's around the area clearly, then don't swim in it. You're better off sticking to a recommended swimming spot. Even if you do swim in a recommended swimming spot and you start to feel ill after a couple of days, it's best to go and see your local GP. Because if you do have leptospirosis, if it goes unnoticed, it can develop into the very serious Wells disease. So there are our top tips to staying safe when wild swimming. Did we miss anything out? What tips would you like to share with us? Let us know in the comments below. If you thought this video was awesome, give it a like, share it with your friends, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And in the words of Colombo, just one more thing, hit that bell icon to keep updated with our latest and greatest videos.